Secret smoke contains approximately 4,000 types of chemicals. 42 of them are carcinogens, also known as substances that cause cancer. Nicotine being the most dangerous substance that increase heartbeat, high level of cholesterol in your blood, increase the chance of coronary artery disease, ischemic heart disease, and raises your blood pressure also. So it will also destroy your lung tissues and air sacs. By smoking one cigarette, your body will receive 0.2 to 2 milligrams of nicotine from smoke. And 70 milligrams from the substance contained in your body will lead to death. Aside from nicotine, cigarette smoke also contains tar, a chemical substance produced from burning tobacco and other plant material that remain in the lungs and the windpipe. Tar is the major contributing factor that causes lung cancer and emphysema, a condition that damages the wall of the excess in the lungs. Carbon monoxide decreases the level of oxygen in the body, which can cause dizziness, make people indecisive, easily tired, and eventually leads to a heart disease. Hydrogen cyanide is also a substance that destroys the upper lining of the windpipe, causing mucus in the throat and chronic cough. Nitrogen dioxide also damages the excess and the lining of bronchial tube that leads to emphysema. It also contains polonium-210, an alpha radioactive agent that is highly responsible for the lung cancer. A smoking causes lung cancer by itself is a toxic substance that can damage the lung cell and itself is a carcinogen that can transform the lung tissue to the cancer. Lung cancer was divided to two types. First is small cell lung cancer. This is accounting for 10% of the lung cancer case. This type is grow and spread quickly. The another type is non-small cell lung cancer. This is accounting for about 90% of lung cancer case. Both two types of this cancer can be killed by surgery if we found in the early state of disease. The most common of symptoms that can be present in lung cancer is chronic cough, dyspnea, chest tightness, hoarseness, hemoptysis, but can be asymptomatic presentation in, in some cases. In lung cancer, we divide into four stages, depend on how far it spread. In stage one, two, and three, it not spread to other part of your body, of patient body. In stage four, it spread to other part of the body that not in lung. Aim of treatments of lung cancer depend on stage. If we found the patient in stage one, two, stage three, the aim of treatment is curative. But if we found a patient in step four, the aim of treatment is control the tumor. So the people who has highest risk of lung cancer include the ones who smoke 20 cigarettes per day for more than 30 years, the ones who smoke 40 cigarettes per day for more than 15 years, and the ones who used to be chain smokers before, but who quit not long then, 15 years ago, and the ones who are secondhand smokers. So these kind of people need to undergo lung cancer screening tests every year because early detection of lung cancer can offer a better cure. Wetany, victory for life.